I'll show you how to find the tempo of any song. Boy, it's too close, bro. Any song when using FL Studio. If you're going to record or add anything to your beat, it's super important to know how to keep everything on the right tempo. You want to start by loading your beat on FL Studio, go all the way to here and change your grid to half step. This will help us to cut the beat easily. Make sure the button stretch is not selected right here. What we want to do right now is try to locate where is the main verse. You know, you usually find it when the 808 drops. So for me, for this beat is around here. So what we want to do is take the beat from the very start and we want to cut all the way to where the hook appears. If you have something like this where if you keep cutting more it's not going to cut exactly at the start. What you can do is put your mouse on the waveform and hold shift and mice wheel up and try to cut it until it comes all the way at the start of the loop right here. So once you cut all the way to the main hook all you want to do is bring this all the way at the start. As you can see right now the default is 140 but this beat is not 140. If we just listen to the beat with this metronome it's going to be off let's take a listen as you can see it's not on beat at all so what we want to do here is try to either boost the bpm or lower it to try to find where it sounds good in on tempo with the metronome bounce of the beat fits with the tempo at 172. A good way to know if your beat is on key is if your drums are following the line of the grid. This is a clap, right? This is like a 808. Sometimes you may think your beat is on beat when you listen to it, let's say here. If I put, let's say, 173. It sounds on beat, right? But let me tell you something, broski. You gotta pay attention right here, dog. Because you may think you have the BPM of a beat at the very start, but then you come at the end and you'll hear how off it actually is. See, by just shifting in from 172 to 173, it's already off beat. That's kind of whack my boy a good way to know if really your beat is on beat is make sure to listen to it at the start and go all the way to the end and see if it perfectly fits the tempo also at the end of the beat so as you can see it fits here as well i want to do it a second time with a different beat just to show you how really easy this thing is a lot of people record on songs or add drums and then they add effects like delay and reverb and because the beat is off tempo the reverb is not hitting right the delay is not hitting right and we're still at 172 but now let's try to find the tempo of this beat so first i want to find where the beat drops so the beat drops around here, right? Where the 808 drops. So I'm gonna make sure it's one half step. Stretch is not selected. I'm gonna cut all the way to the beat drop. So once again, we have the same issue. So I'm gonna have to do shift and mouse wheel. So around here, the beat starts. All right, let's bring it back to the start and let's hear with the tempo. See, it's off beat. You gotta make sure the drums are hitting on the actual line of the grid. Okay, this sounds on beat. Let me double check at the end. Once that's done, all you have to do is just bring your beat back to like a, a eight bar, let's say, and just bring everything back to normal. A lot of y'all might come up with crazy ass BPM, like something like fucking 280 or 300. While that might be in tempo for the beat that you're using, let me tell you something, homie, they say it is. If it's something that is too slow, let's say like 40 BPM, if this is on tempo with your beat, you need to double that by two. So most likely it's going to be like 80. If it's too high or like something like 240 most likely that's not the actual bpm it's 240 divided by 2 so 120 i was confused there I, I wasn't sure if i did the math right but yeah 240 divided by 2 120 quick nice hey graduated bitch <laughs> swag yolo plus <laughs> are you a swag gangster tell me are you swag okay, yo, <laughs> are you mainly using thai beats from youtube or are you actually making your own beats definitely let me know in the comments down below i'd love to talk with you and i'd be more than happy Happy to help you out if you have any other issue, bros. Let's go. Get that too. Dude, let's go. <sighs> Damn, you stink. Make sure to subscribe. Whoa, what the fuck? Make sure to subscribe for more videos like these. Nuts. Got him. <laughs> and come chill with me on this next video, bro. Swag, yellow plus. Gain shit, cuz. Gain shit, bro. <laughs>